So we have finally made it back up to the top of Farnhill Pinnacle. I'm a slightly exhausted and tired and a bit shaken up active gamer YouTube and welcome back to my stomping ground. So a few of you may be wondering why I am a bit shaken up, a bit tired because I have just come back up from pushing all the way back up from the bottom of the hill right to the very top up here uh, from the Black Route. If you guys haven't checked out my previous mountain biking video I do highly recommend you do that before this one because um, I don't think it will get any tougher than that up here, uh, not that I know of anyway or not that I'm hoping today. We are doing the brown route, that is right, or should I say today, oh, yeah, today we're doing the brown route, goggles on, we're going to get straight on with it, hopefully we don't encounter any traffic, it is a nice evening up here, so this brown route is like more of an enduro type of route, I like to call it, uh, a few nice little fast sections through here, or through the trees, trying not to catch the bars on any of the trees, and uh, that has gone very well so far it's a nice flowy like loamy trail this one not no big roots or big rocks on it until we get near the bottom a bit more of a fast one i do like my fast as you can tell straight fast down here trying not to miss the turning which you nearly did there and straight down there hard on the brakes at the bottom so we don't case the little stream that does run near this section I think it is just at the bottom of here uh, no, maybe not, we have just surpassed the stream without knowing but straight back onto the power I've done this trail before on one of my first mountain biking videos up here so as you can see it's just so fast it's just trying not to get caught on like the small loose rocks it's just there's quite a few different line choices along here try not to get caught up in that little rut and the back tire does feel a bit solid uh, a bit soft so we're just gonna have a quick stop no back tire is all still full up so straight back on the gas now i feel like i've got a bit more of my technique back dialed since the first video we did back up here returning on my mountain bike check that out in the description but yeah just all the way down it's just full on small little rocks trying to throw you off trying to keep the front and rear wheel on the same path so you don't get any unexpected little buckaroo moments and this takes you out near like the kind of the heart of the area up here Looking out, making sure there is no people with dogs without a leash so we don't run them over. But this does take us to the end. Well, first half, end of the first half. So we're gonna push down here. This is the bit where you recognize that we didn't unfortunately manage to ride up last time out. Fast down here, open up your brakes, and then a bit of a Pedally section up here, trying not to lose as much speed as possible. And this is where it gets nice and fun. It's quite dark through here, a lot of overhanging trees. So hopefully the camera doesn't make contact with a lot of them. Now it is quite overgrown down here. I didn't expect this. Should maybe have looked out before coming down here, but yeah, nice and fast again down here. This is what I love about the brown route, it's just so fast you gotta keep a bit rocky there, a bit of a wet rock, but nothing that won't hinder us. See the sun is right in my eyes so it's hard to see all the way down here but not too much of a problem because not many people come up here. But it's just the one single trail all the way down now to the road. Just hard on the brakes in case there is an unexpected walker trying to not catch my camera on that branch there quite a lot of sharp 
things like bushes sticking out but this has been quite a successful run sorry i'm kind of getting away from explaining the route and just trying to well i'm kind of, I'm kind of talking through what i'm doing but tight right hander here just these you can grab your handlebars and kind of like take you make you part of the mountain forever but thankfully that hasn't happened it has happened a couple of times along here but we are getting now to the end of the trail lots of lots of scratches on my arm but here we go the end of the trail before pulling out we are going to make sure there is no cars and it doesn't sound like it no there isn't but that is going to end it for today's video just going to have to make <laughs> going to opposite side of the road here sorry about that guys but yeah uh, that is going to end it for this second run of the night it's going to be uploaded in a different video just to add a bit more variation but yeah that was the brown route i do love that route so fast and flowy i'm going to try and come up here when it's a bit quieter so i can like tr fully go for it and try and maybe explain that route or just make it just one tick but without any further ado hope you guys did enjoy the video please drop a like if you did and yeah i'll catch you on the flip side i will i will see you then take care see ya